Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about the arc length. So now I will show you how to answer. First, we need to find first the refer to of y. That is about this one. So if we do first the refer to of L and of side of S over 2, we will have about side S over 2 in here. Later that, we do first the refer to of side of S over 2 on the nominator, oh sorry, numerator. So this one, we have 1 over 2 cosine of S over 2. Number 2 and 1 over 2, we simplify. And this one, we have cotang of S over 2. Next, we apply the formula. So, we have L equals to the integration from A to B. And we have the square root of 1 plus first derivative of y to the power of 2. And I will put about the s. So I will put this one going here. And this one we will have about cosecant of s over 2 square. A and B, that is about this one and this one. We know that from B over 3 to B cosecant of s over 2 that's still about positive because we need to transform this one into the absolute value of cosecant of s over 2 because this one from b over 3 to b they are positive for cosecant of s over 2 and now we need to cancel the absolute value and now the integration of this one, we have negative number 2. Number 2, that's a form coefficient of s. That's about 1 over 2. So we have 1 divided by 1 over 2. You got about number 2. Ln of the absolute value of cosecant of s over 2 plus cotang of s over 2. And we put the bounds from B over 3 to B. And now we have the final answer. So we put B going here and here. B over 3 we put in here and here. Now, we need to calculate about this one. So this one, we have ln number 1. This one, we have number 2 in here. This one, we have the square root of number 3. Ln number 1, you got 0. So we have this one left. This is the end. Thank you for watching.